rest in storms luke chapter 8 and verse 25 but he said to them where is your faith and they were afraid and marveled saying to one another who can this be for he commands even the winds and water and they obey him so this is when jesus asked his disciples to get on to the boat so they could go to the other side uh, and while they were journeying to the other side uh, uh, there was a great storm and the disciples were full of fear they did not know what to do and they went and woke jesus up jesus rebuked them in fact and then he he rebuked the storm uh, and then he makes the statement and he asks them where is your faith and his disciples are marveling at the fact that here is a man whose voice can even calm the winds and the waves so uh, it seems to us that jesus had an expectation from his disciples when they faced storms now the characteristic of this storm is that jesus had invited them on a journey now even in our lives you know, there are decisions that we've made in line with god's word but things may not be smooth sailing we may be encountering uh, challenges from every side and wondering did i hear god right did i uh, make the move in the right direction why is it so difficult you know, why is it uh, so challenging but even when we are walking uh, in step with god we can face storms but those storms jesus expects us to face with faith you know uh, when jesus was told about the storm he knew that he had authority over the storm so he simply goes up and issues a command and that is what jesus had expected his disciples to do he wanted his disciples to know the authority which they had and exercise that authority and also to do this from a place of rest and not from a place of fear so this is what i want to leave with us when we face our storms in life our storms in life could be sickness it could be you know the uh, uh, lack of an opportunity uh, we we could be in a place where we we need more resources to fulfill what god wants us to do so there can be all kinds of storms that we are going through uh, but let's approach it from a place of faith let's approach it from a place of authority rebuke the storm because god has given us the authority to speak to the winds and the waves let's pray together heavenly father we thank you that lord we can respond to the storms in our lives by faith oh god and even today god i take authority over every storm that is rising against your people oh god i rebuke that storm in the name of jesus and i command the stillness of the lord to to be made manifest thank you for your peace oh god thank you for your breakthrough thank you for releasing the miracles in jesus name we pray amen thank you for tuning in to living supernaturally For more resources to strengthen your spiritual walk, please visit apcwo.org.